morning everyone i hope you guys are doing good guys in this episode we are going to discuss the summer training or the internship opportunity you can say for most of the students who belongs to science engineering uh, and technology background uh, so you can start it from bsc to msc so this opportunity is available at the institute of advanced studies in uh, in science and technology Uh, which is an autonomous institute which comes under the department of science and technology it means the dst government of india so uh, to search this uh, opportunity you have to go to the notice board but where like if you if you type this iist.gov.in in google you will be redirected to the this, this particular page and in notice you will find the thing like so many uh, notices are there one of them is uh, the the particular opportunity for the training and so on so so another thing you can just check it here uh, we are not going to wait for this but i have downloaded the uh, advertisement and you can, we can check it here so let's see uh, i'll open the pdf so now we'll discuss more about this opportunity so here as i mentioned this uh, institute of advanced uh, studies in science and technology uh, it is uh, situated in the Pash- pashim boragaon uh, in guwahati this advertisement is posted uh, on 30th of march 2023 advertisement number is 416 so as i mentioned this is internship or project dissertation so last up uh, uh, the advertisement which we saw it was not like dissertation it was just the internship program but it is the uh, you can use this uh, internship as a project dissertation as well at the ias iasst guwahati so we'll see the more details in in this i have mentioned it, it comes under the department of science technology so that you can uh, evaluate or you can uh, compare the 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 status of the training or uh, the importance of the training which you did uh, uh, from which you will do do it from the uh, the uh, department of science and technology affiliated one of the institute so so if we, if it comes to the subject uh, like institute is engaged in frontier areas such as uh, specific domain of the physics chemi- chemical uh, mathematical or life sciences now here aim to contribute to the basic research or develop technology local researches through the strong interdisciplinary research approach so this many opportunity or uh, sorry i'm sorry so this many uh, instruments high end instruments they have like uh, if i mention xrd sem lcms fm and dna sequencer computational uh, facility for the like cutting edge research so this summer internship, internship uh is vacancy is available for the 2023 to 2024 session uh, which will be short term summer internship for 2 months and the project dissertation uh, or you can say the training it is for the 6 month in the following areas if we look at the areas uh this uh, phytopharmaceuticals for the metabolic syndrome pharmaceutical sciences molecular pharmacology uh ethanol pharmacology drug pharmacology snake venom biochemistry for this uh, subject area eligibility criteria they have mentioned candidate who is pursuing the masters or uh, what we can say the msc btech in microbiology biochemistry biotechnology molecular biology zoology cell biology life sciences or m pharma ms uh, pharma or m tech in pharmaceutical so most of the life science and uh, pharmaceutical department uh, ph- pharmaceutical domain is covered in this particular uh, Uh, subject area uh, in 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 case of plant uh, plant microbe interactions microbial uh, bioactive molecules and the eligibility is candidate pursuing msc in botany microbiology uh, specialization microbiology or biotechnology the third subject is the uh, probiotic and uh, uh, human microbiome for this candidate pursuing bsc so earlier two were for the msc but this is for the Uh, bsc candidate so uh, i think our bsc subscriber they can apply for this uh, for the tra- this uh, internship program or msc in life sciences zoology microbiology biochemistry 
biotechnology and molecular biology so if you are bsc you will have one of its uh, one of the subject from this uh, list or if you are msc you will have a specialization for this so in in case of nano science nanotechnology polity electrolytes nano composites or biochemical sensors candidate pursuing msc in physics uh, or chemistry biotechnology nano science and nanotechnology are eligible to apply for this position in case of the uh, physics or plasma physics it is i think it's one of the burning subject nowadays uh, plasma physics the condensed matter physics material science material chemistry soft matter physics in this uh, candidate who is pursuing mostly the engineering students btech mtech or msc in physics chemistry material science and engineering technology chemical engineering electronics electrical engineering and botany all of them are eligible to apply for this position now biophysics and plasma radiation candidate who is pursuing msc biophysics uh, chemistry or physical uh, sorry physics mtech in biotechnology or medical devices or pharmacy now the the uh, another subject is the chemo bio treatment for the bio contaminants on water soils mostly i think it's by bio, biotechnology i was about to say so candidate pursuing msc in uh, having a specialization with the msc uh, what we can say the chemistry or biotechnology are eligible to apply now uh, we can't deny the uh, presence of artificial intelligence nowadays because uh whatever we are using the technological aspects uh, ai is capturing everything so it's it's important topic so in application of artificial intelligence can it pursuing b b tech m tech m mca msc computer science it and the allied subjects like ee all of them are eligible to apply for this position in case of mathematical science i forgot to mention earlier i mentioned science and technology and engineering but here mathematical science is also is there so mathematics in applied mathematics statistics or hydrodynamics candidate pursuing msc or mtech in mathematics or applied math statistics and mathematical and computing all of them are eligible to apply for this position now we'll see the most important part which is the uh, application process so here uh, uh, as i mentioned earlier in first uh, uh, in para or uh, starting the video this website i am going to give in the description box you can go and uh, you can check this so you have to apply online i have opened this application form you can see it here so uh, this is the website and this is the application form if you click here uh you can find you have to register here and uh, if, you, if you have registered you you just need to click it here so we'll, i i'm going to give this link in the description box you can go there and check it so within 15 days of application which means this advertise is posted 30 to uh, 13th of march you can check it so today is i think 11th yeah it's 11th here probably in india it is 12th uh, so i you have 3 days to apply from the date of publication so incomplete applications will be will not be entertained candidate should submit the no objection certificate from the parent institute doing online submission so if you are a uh, student of this particular university suppose you are a student of nagpur university you have to submit the noc certificate from this uh, hod or the university or research institute dean whatever it is uh, self declaration also you have to submit and then selection process will be uh, on merit based based on the last semester marks so it's pretty easy i think it's not going to be hard job for the candidate who is like studious or uh, uh, who who always who is always good in the uh, subject so uh, you have to selected uh, the selected candidate list will be uh, they, they they are going to display on the website so i'll again the you have to check regularly check the website again uh, internship dissertation and training fee so candidate selected for the project dissertation i think it is paid so you have to pay non refundable 2500 rupees per month towards the laboratory technician chemical equipment and handling cost so candidate select for the internship will not be charged for any fee so here two categories are there one is uh, internship and one is the project dissertation if you are if you want to do dissertation you have to pay to to yeah 2500 means almost 6 uh yeah it will be more than uh, 10000 so you have to pay this much 
and uh, for internship there will be no fees accommodation uh, the accommodation for the institute dormitory is available and subject to availability during the time when you join uh, preference will be given student from outside the guwahati means if you are applying from the maharashtra you can like claim that i am out of state student so i need this uh, you can ask them they, they are going to provide it so this internship program program will start with uh, in june 2023 and dissertation training from the uh, july 23 so uh, i think our most most of the subscriber except i don't know everything i think uh, all subjects we have covered here except food sciences but uh, if you if you have like bsc if you are bsc students or if you have any M msc specialization or without uh, having any uh, specialization like food science and other things if you have other subject like biochemistry biotechnology you can apply so here the link of application is available if i click here it will be so my computer doesn't have do not have, uh, my computer doesn't allow me to do this so i'm going to give this link in the description box if you are eligible please go there do apply and don't forget to subscribe to the channel thank you have a nice day bye bye